What's going on guys? This is my uh, contest, contest entry video for uh, Paducah Fish Fans uh, uh, Cobalt Aquatics uh, contest that he's got going now. Um, it's basically to show off my tank. So uh, let me tell you a little bit about my tank. It's a uh, 120 tall. Um, it's uh, 4 foot long by 2 foot deep by 2 foot high. Um, it is. I have uh, 4 uh, T5 um, bulbs running on it. Uh, two 6500K bulbs, uh, one uh, pink plant spectrum bulb, and then one uh, blue actinic bulb um, to kind of highlight the fish's colors. Um, fish right now, um, I'm not going to go through all the fish, but some of the cooler fish that I have in this tank. Um, I have a black ghost knife. Uh, he's kind of sitting in that log right there up front. Uh, you can kind of see him just a little bit, but uh, um, he's probably my favorite fish in this tank uh, just because he's so unique. Um, I've got some gold angelfish in there that I'm pretty proud of, and then also a twig catfish that likes to hide out in the back. And those are probably my uh, those are probably my highlight fish, the ones that I'm uh, that I'm most proud of. Um, some things about this tank: I've had this tank for less than a year. I got it in March of last year, um, and started off with just a uh, pirate ship decoration and um, some fake plants, and that's it. And then uh, as I got more into fish keeping, uh, things started to change. Uh, about six months ago, I put my first plants in this tank and I uh, really liked the way that looked. And so I switched from fake plants to all real. In fact, the only thing fake I have, the fake decoration I have in this tank is that log up front. And that's only because the black ghost knife uh, really likes to have a place to hide. Um, and that gives them a, a kind of a safe haven to go to during the day um, just to get away. Um, you know the the fish stock has changed in this tank quite a bit as I uh, you know learned more and figured out what my uh, tastes were. Um, yeah, those angelfish are fighting like crazy. They're the only fish that show any kind of aggression in my tank, um, and that's just because I have two pairs in there. Every three to four weeks they're laying eggs. It seems like. Um, but anyways. Um, yeah, now it, for an experienced aquarist, someone who's been doing this for years and years, this tank's probably not uh, something to brag about. I mean, it looks nice, but it's probably, you know, uh, I haven't, you know, accomplished any major feats for someone who's been doing this for years. Um, but um, I think what gives me a chance in this contest is that I have been keeping fish for less than, or for just over a year now. Um, I got our first tank uh, back in January of last year. It was a 30 gallon that I still have up and running uh, in our bedroom. And uh, then in March of last year, um, talked to my wife into letting me get this thing. I got it off Craigslist. Um, so I've been keeping fish for less than a year. Um, I really didn't I didn't have much experience other than we had a fish tank in my house growing up, and uh, I really didn't do much with it. Um, so I'm pretty proud of the success that I've had, especially in keeping plants. I've done a lot of. Uh, um, you know, done a lot of research and stuff like that, trying to uh, learn as much as possible, um, as quickly as possible. Um, you know, I, I, I've had some failures and I've had a lot, uh, some successes in this tank, and I'm pretty proud of what I've accomplished in just a year's time, or less than a year's time. Um, I'm pretty proud of where this tank's at. Um, I'll tell you a little bit about some of the plants I've got in here. I've got some Anubias, a couple different kinds. Um, I have. Uh, some pygmy chainsaw, which you see that up front, uh, several different types of crypts, uh, some wisteria, uh, hygrophilia, uh, ponageton, olvaceus, um, which is the one that's sending that flower stem, those flower stems up, uh, some giant valve there in the background, uh, uh, cardinal, two cardinal plants, lobelia cardinalis, um, and those are doing pretty well. Um, but yeah, I'm just uh, really excited about this tank. Excited about what it's, you know, um, what it looks like. Uh, excited with the success that I've had in just a short amount of time that I've been doing this. Um, it's not perfect, you know. I'm still trying to, still working to get to that balance. To get that balance that, uh, you know, playing the tank people, oh, fish, you know, uh, fish tank people talk about, you know, balance in their tank. I'm still, you know, working to get there. Uh, trying to uh, equal everything out. Um, you know, trying to uh, keep the algae in check and at the same time keep the plants growing healthy. Um, but yeah, I mean, this is, 
I'm proud of this tank. I think this tank looks great for you know the little amount of experience, of experience that I've had with this. Um, I'm going to keep at it and uh, you know keep doing what I'm doing. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a good one.